When we assume office in January, you can rest assured of one thing. The war will be over. Specifically, the war our proxy government has been waging against a civilian population, us, will be declared lost. Hopelessly, irrevocably, and gratefully lost. We will proceed immediately with a reconstitution plan along the lines of the so-called Marshall Plan, though its true name, the European Recovery Program, is more apt. For we, like post-war Europe, are beset by a deterioration of our cities, factories, and infrastructure. Long-standing institutions, banks, schools, universities, hospitals, manufacturers, not only no longer serve, but stand in the way of a healthy civic life. We are in need of an American recovery program. Yet even the word recovery is not wholly fitting, for we do not propose to merely recover old institutions with new veneers, for as Max Weber said, institutions exist to perpetuate themselves. Rather, our plan is for an American renovation plan, a plan to renew, revitalize, and reinvigorate America from top to bottom. Our young country is not the moribund, ossified, tradition-bound state that others are. We are an innovative, enthusiastic, and valiant people, and that is exactly why we propose to make of our government founded to be of, by, and for the people, an innovative, enthusiastic, and valiant government. So I say again, come January, it's all hands on deck and full speed ahead. <laughs>